As you just saw on ESPN, Michigan beats Purdue. Desmond Howard trying his hand at the high hurdles. Didn't get it done there, but he did have a couple of touchdowns as the Wolverines roll over Purdue 42 0. Welcome back. Chris Fowler along with Lee Corso. We've talked about Michigan being in the driver's seat in the Big Ten. Gary Danielson made an interesting point during the telecast. Michigan's offense, he says that they use that spread formation, almost an impossible offense to stop. Anybody stop them from here right now in the Big Ten? I don't think anybody can stop in the Big Ten. Washington can, can stop them. I don't care what they do. What Gary's talking about is excellent. They have an automatic system now with Gerback that they got from the Cincinnati Bengals where he can sit up there and call the place. I think it's sensational back effective again today, although he didn't play that much. And even in the cold weather, Desmond Howard still a couple of touchdowns for Michigan. Okay, we want to go back and hear now from the Magic Man, Michigan's Heisman candidate, had two more touchdowns today, and he spoke with Gary Danielson after the ball game. Here's their conversation. All right, thanks, Chris. I'm with Desmond Howard. And Desmond, I haven't been calling you Magic Man. Are you upset with me? You look played like a Magic Man, but I've been saying that nickname's been taken. Great game today. Hey, thank you, Gary. You know, I'm just come out here and uh, try to play consistent to help my team get back to Pasadena for the Rose Bowl. You know, you've had a lot of single coverage in the Big Ten. Has that surprised you that they're not giving you more double coverage near the goal line? Yeah, I think it surprised us. Um, at this point in the season, you think that they with double coverages, but you still have to uh, pay a lot of attention to the running game, so they can't afford to double cover me all day. You know, I bet was reading in the paper that you don't think your quarterback, Elvis Gerback, gets a lot of, n enough credit for throwing that ball to you in the right spot. Why don't you talk about Elvis a little bit? Well, as I said before, um, Elvis is definitely the smartest player on the field on Saturdays. Our offense comes and go with Elvis, and uh, he was brilliant out there today, and that's why we were able to put so many points on the board. You know, Michigan's always been known for not pushing one guy for individual awards, but don't you think that this Heisman Trophy should come up north and a guy from Michigan, maybe Desmond Howard, it's about time somebody won it up here? Yeah, it's definitely about time someone won it up north. But like, like you said, Michigan's not really pushing it for an individual player. It's just uh, our performances stay consistent week in and week out, and uh, if they're judging it by our performances, then we'll see at the end of the season who wins the award. You know, Casey Weldon, I don't know if you know, he was hooked up and watching you live, just like you were hooked up last Saturday watching him live, and he was just marveling at your catches. What impressed you about Casey Weldon when you played against him? Uh, well, I didn't really get the good chance to see Casey Weldon play, but when I seen him last week, the way he came back and led his team to victory was definitely... Um, what a Heisman candidate should do, and he did it in a good fashion. Okay, we've seen you all year now. You've been scoring two touchdowns every game. Are we ever going to see you have a good game? <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully I'll be able to finish off the season with a consistent consistent effort and uh, help our team get back to the Rose Bowl as the outright Big Ten champions. All right, you're truly magic, Desmond Howard, and a great year this year. It's been a joy watching you play. All right, thanks, Gary. All right, back to you, Chris. All right, Gary, Desmond knows big ball games ahead against Illinois and Ohio State. All the Heisman candidates saying the right thing. So political this year. We heard Weldon complimenting Desmond and now him doing the reverse there.